But why would a shepherd lead a sheep into a valley with danger and death, thread after thread after thread? Why, why would God lead us into places like that? Isn't the only possible answer to get to some better place? And, and are, we, are, are we comforted because he is with us on this journey? Yes. Why are we comforted? Right there. For you are with me. Even when I walk through the valley of the shadow of death, I will fear no evil, for you are with me. And, and we have to think about this too, in, in terms of our shepherd image, which is, which is still in full force in, in this part of the, of the text. In the story of David and Goliath, we're reminded by David himself that a, that a shepherd was far from this sort of meek, gentle character that's often portrayed in paintings and uh, Christian you know, uh, art, but, uh, but was kind of a rough and tumble character. In, in 1 Samuel 17, it says, But David said to Saul, Your servant used to keep sheep for his father. And when there came a lion or a bear and took a lamb from the flock, I went after him and struck him and delivered it out of his mouth. And if he arose against me, I caught him by the beard and I struck him and killed him. That's the work of a shepherd. A halfway decent shepherd is going to be able to fight off things that endanger the sheep. And that's what's in view here when David's talking about the rod and the staff. That's the protection that's afforded under the care of Yahweh. I will be protected by the rod. I will be led by the crook. I will be kept out of harm's way from stepping, from falling into uh, to marshes, from those sorts of things. I will be led and you will be with me. 